Hello everyone! Today I have a Walmart grocery haul. My kids started school this week, so I went ahead and meal planned for two weeks instead of my normal one. So here's the meal plan. Sunday I had slow cooker beef stew with rolls. Monday I had leftovers. Tuesday, which was yesterday, was my birthday and my mom and kids surprised me with pizza and cheesecake. It was amazing. Today I am really not feeling good. I have some kind of a cold or something and I did not cook. Tomorrow I will be making horseradish butter steak with loaded baked potatoes. Friday I'm making marmalade pork and Saturday I'm making fried rice. Sunday I'm making peach Dijon pork with sweet potatoes. Monday I'm making spaghetti with meat sauce and garlic knots. Tuesday loaded tater tots with mac and cheese. Wednesday a burrito rice bowl. Thursday baked dish, which is a family recipe. Friday, pizza and mozzarella sticks. And Saturday, naked pasta and broccoli. Naked pasta is just pasta with butter, parmesan, and garlic. And now for the groceries. Some of my favorite bread and some Hawaiian hamburger buns. 24 eggs. Frozen berries for my bunnies. My favorite pizza. Mozzarella sticks to go with the pizza. My first time buying ground chicken, I'm using it in my fried rice. Two big ass two pound bags of shredded collard greens. I ordered the fresh ones, but they were out. So they sent me these and my bunnies are all stocked up on fresh produce for a while. Celery also for my bunnies. Carrots for me and for the bunnies. Four limes, an avocado, and a gigantic ass green bell pepper for the bunnies. It is the size of my hand. A pork butt roast. I divide this in half for two different meals. Mustard greens for the bunnies. Romaine hearts for me if I want to make a salad this week. Turnip greens for the bunnies. Tater tots for me, veggies for my fried rice, better cheddar sausages and some honey ham, a variety of cheeses, coleslaw for fried rice and imitation crab for another meal, frozen peas for baked dish, sweet corn also for baked dish, cream cheese regular sausage and maple sausage links. My first watermelon of the season. It looks amazing. I can't wait to crack into it. Water flavoring, all non-caffeinated this time. Black olives, marinara sauce, and black beans. My favorite chips. This time the bag was full. Two cans of tomato soup and a can of refried beans. Some delicious cookies. Sunflower seeds and bacon canned potatoes, pickled beets, and black beans, a variety of pasta, my very favorite spaghetti and it's only 75 cents for one pack, scallop potatoes to serve alongside one of my meals, two packs of taco seasoning and two cans of chili, dressing and parmesan, lower sodium soy sauce, evaporated milk, salt and pepper, a Cadbury Caramello bar and some cowtail candy, some daytime nighttime cold medicine, strawberry fruit and grain bars, these things are addictive, peach preserves for my Dijon peach pork, and sliced potatoes and Dijon mustard. Kitten food, they're starting this week and it's gonna be messy. Oatmeal and brownie mix. Soda, I got two Mountain Dew Zero and two A&W. I did not want to move the boxes and the kittens were exploring because they're teething and they want to bite everything. <laughs> <laughs> cat food for the adult cats inside and outside my house. Nosy kittens who wanted to sniff 
bite and attack everything I set up here. Bunny food being tested by the kittens because I guess plastic tastes good. I don't know. <laughs> They're silly. <sighs> they were biting everything. As you can see. Dry kitten food. I'm going to try the wet first and see how that goes before I give them the kibble. But I'm assuming they like it because they kept attacking the bag. <laughs> That's it. I will see you when I see you. Thank you for watching.